Hey guys, what's up? Ty Ty the Gamer Guy here, and welcome back to Super Luigi Sleeping 64 DS. In the last episode, we rescued Luigi and got some more power stars that we normally wouldn't be able to get without him. In this episode, we're not going to be going in there, even though I already spoiled what's in there, because I just wanted to unlock it just to get it over with. We're going to be going in here. We are now into the basement of the castle, and... I always thought this was cool. There's blue fire right here. And I believe there is one thing we can do yet. What does this toad have to say? Wow, you recovered that many stars! Way to go, Mario! What? what? You're Luigi? I don't believe it! Luigi couldn't have pulled off such an impress- Well, screw you too! Luigi is the best character in the game! Stop trying to fool me! Mario, you might be wearing clean clothes! Green, clo green clothes? But I don't think you can tell- I can tell you two apart! Fine, if you're really Luigi, you'll be able to spin in the air after a backward somersault! Oh god, that toad was really getting on to me. Ugh, you'll also have amazing agility and be able to run on water for a second. You'll also, he's basically just telling us everything that I already did. Hey, <laughs> whoops, am I... The cord's all tangled up there for a sec. No, oh, don't tell me I have, I have the hiccups now. Oh god, hiccups are the worst. I believe there was one thing that's down here that we can get, but it doesn't look like that it's here. Maybe. Hmm. Well, in the meantime, well, we have a couple things we can do right here. We have a painting in here, a door over here, and a uh, wink wink dead end over here. So, which one do I want to tackle first? Let's go in here first. Welcome to Lethal Lava Land. That's a very kind of menacing name, a Lethal Lava Land. Yeah, I'm pretty sure lava is lethal, so uh, I guess it's even more lethal. <laughs> anyway, boil the big bully. I'm pretty sure everyone who has had a bully wants to boil their bully. Don't be a pushover. If anyone tries to shove you around, push them back. It's a one-on-one -on -one with fiery and for the loser. That is pretty gruesome. So anyway, as you can see right here, this place is covered in lava. And over here, we have a new enemy. This is one of the bullies. <laughs> great first, <laughs> great first uh, show off, me. So what you need to do is. You can either punch them, kick them, or ground pound them, and you just shove them off the platform. And... And they die and they drop out a coin. That's not gruesome at all. We have yet another Mr. I. I believe there is a wing cap if you're using Mario here, and... Well, and over here is... Oh, no, no, no! Oh. So if you if you get hit by fire or touch the lava, you'll lose you'll just like start running around uncontrollably for a little bit. You have to jump. You don't want to you know try not to get hit anywhere. Anyway, over here we have quite possibly the easiest eight red coin missions in the game. Well, probably not easiest. Well, easiest because you know those those panels are moving around. They could you know, move under your feet and you'll make you take damage in the lava and stuff. Anyway, that's not important for right now. What we need to do is over here. And over here we had the big bully. Let's toast him. The sound they make when they die, or when, the, when they get hit. <laughs> they don't even make a sound when they die. I mean, that's that's honestly kind of sad. And power star number forty-eight. Triple jump right into it. Sweet. Bully the bullies. That's exactly what you want to do to a bully. If you have a bully, just bully your bully. Well, I guess not always bully bully your bully, because, I mean, you would really be no better than him. Slash her, so, I don't know. So, uh, don't take what I said literally, I guess. <laughs> what we need to do is go over there. There's a power flower over here, I think. I'm gonna get it just for the hell of it. 
And of course, even though we are invisible, we still take damage when we touch the lava. Which, I mean, it's not surprising, but you know. And let's do my broken back button to get over there. There we go, and frame rate drops. Come on. I was doing pretty well with this at the start. Come on. Let's not have frame rate drops already. Oh, can I get two for Get it? Oh, rip. I was trying to move when I was get two for the price of one. But oh well. We toast those bulls, and we have yet another rematch with the big bully. I mean, we, we, I just killed you. How'd you come back to life? And now I killed you again. And power star number 49. Eight coin puzzle with 15 pieces. Yeah, I was just talking about this a little bit ago. Now, I am a little... Hmm. I'm a little conflicted on what to do right here because, you know, normally I like to, I like to tackle the 100 coin mission on top of the 8 red coin mission, but... There's actually not 100 coins in this part of Lethal Lava Land. There's actually a whole other section that we have, that we have to explore, but... We won't be able, but you know, the the first mission where we get to explore that level, that portion is not in here, so I don't exactly want to spoil it just yet. So you actually, yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and do the eight red coin mission, just get it done and over with. Then I'll do, then I'll do the 100 coin mission, like afterwards, like after I after I get to what I was talking about for the first time. Anyway, so like I said, you do want to be a little careful. Now you don't, you know, go on a piece that's about to slide over, and... Boom. Power Star number 50. It's pretty crazy that we're already on episode 11, we already have, you know, 50, fa 50 Power Stars. You've recovered 50 Power Stars, and that's enough to open the star door on the third floor. So we will be going there for quite a while. So, so yeah, the game spoiled that there's that there's a whole another floor that we have to explore. So, but we will, but we won't be going there for quite some time. Anyway, I forgot what this mission was called already. But anyway, what we need to do is over here, and if we had a certain character getting over there, would be a lot easier. And oh, hold on, actually, there's a Mario cap over here, and I believe there's a wing cap somewhere. I can just fly over there. Where I should be able to fly over there. Let's find out. So, I'm giving up. Uh, hold on. I just derped really hard. I saw red. I immediately linked it to Mario. <laughs> okay. Is this? Okay. Well, this is a power. I'm, I know there's a wing cap somewhere. There has to be one. I, I know there was one in the original games. I believe it was over on this little island over here. I mean, if this even is an island. And... There we go, yep. Memory served me right. So we need to go over here. So let's just, you know, fly over there. to make our lives easier. Okay, I need to go ahead and do another jump over there. I mean, we could ride that little metal cage thing, but that's boring. I want to fly over there. And, oh, uh... Or I could just break this level entirely. <laughs> Power Star number 51! Well, I... Wow, so yeah, the Wing Cat, you can easily break that level. What you're supposed to do? Is go on that log and you just keep running, keep running on it to make it go forward without falling off until you get to the until you get to the power star. But I completely broke that level. All right, well I think we're gonna call it right there. I'll see you guys next time.